Lehigh Valley Church that was heavily damaged by fire on Tuesday didn't even have the chance to rebuild before a second blaze ripped through it this morning. As eyewitness news reporter Matt Petrillo shows us, police believe the first fire was arson and the second could be related. It's upsetting. It's really upsetting. More than 50 years of memories inside the Pentecostal Church of Bethlehem are now in ruins. Everything from the altar to pews and even religious items are destroyed after two fires in two days. When you first see it and it, it impacts you, it's like seeing like a, like a close family member that passed or something like that. The first fire broke out Tuesday. Police believe it to be a case of arson, although they have not named any suspects. Today's blaze happened around 2 a.m. That's when Eyewitness News found an accelerant detection canine sniffing around. Worshippers say police told them the second fire is likely related. We will do this again. I mean, they already burned everything inside. What else can you burn? What else can you burn here? Today, detectives focused much of their investigation on the roof. Church members want whoever set the flames here to turn themselves in. We'll forgive him, and the people of the Church of Bethlehem will also forgive him. There's going to be something great that comes out of this. So, I mean, we're going to build bigger and better. And authorities are hoping a $5,000 reward will help them find whoever started the fire. In Bethlehem, Matt Petrillo, CBS 3 Eyewitness News.